Hey folks, I'm Brad with PCMac.com and today we're going to take a quick look at Windows Update, uh, show you how to set it up for automatic updates, or show you how to install those updates yourself, or maybe uninstall an update that you didn't like. Uh, so first things first, you're going to open the Start menu here, click on the Settings option, and you're going to go to the Update and Security option here. Here you'll be able to manually check for updates. So you can check the up for updates button. It'll go through and look. I believe I should be up to date here. So it's usually pretty fast. Yep, it's up to date. So again, you just click that button and it'll do a manual check on whether you're up to date or not. Uh, there are some advanced options. So you can choose how your updates are installed. Uh, you can click automatic. It'll download and install automatically when you're not using it. Uh, or there's the notify to schedule restart. Uh, they'll be downloaded automatically but won't be installed autom automatically. Uh, one important thing to note is that you actually can't really pick and choose updates anymore with Windows 10, uh, at least from my understanding. Um, everything is just automatically downloaded and installed on your computer and you just don't have control in that area anymore. Um, so really it is, no matter what you choose, it is a automatic update. You're only choosing the uh, control of when to install them. Now if you don't like an update, you can actually go to your update history I believe and uninstall updates uh, or the latest preview build. So if you go through, you click the uninstall updates button, it'll take you to this tab and let you pick and choose which updates to uninstall. Uh, I'm not going to uninstall any of these because most of these are actually security updates. You can uninstall the latest preview build too. Uh, usually requires resetting your PC um, but that's really all there is to it uh, you really like I said you really don't have that control that you might have had in uh, Windows 8 or even 8.1 uh, or even Windows 7 uh, so really everything is already automatic and you really don't have to worry about anything it's just more of a choice of when you want to install it and that's all there is to it for more great videos, you can head on over to the YouTube channel and for a, uh, a whole lot more detailed article on keeping your PC up to date with maintenance, you can click the link below. Once again, I've been Brad with PCMech.com, and until next time.